ever wonder how many electrolytes you lose through sweat? That's going to be the topic of our brain bomb for today. Now, as endurance athletes, we know electrolytes are important for a few main reasons. They help our body hold on to more water. They prevent hyponatremia, might prevent cramping, and help maintain blood volume. But have you ever stopped and wondered how many electrolytes you actually lose through sweat? Probably not, but I'm going to tell you anyways. So, on average, for every pound of sweat you lose, and this is averages, if heat and humidity is higher, these numbers may be higher, but averages, for every pound of sweat, you lose about 500 milligrams of sodium, 390 milligrams of chloride, 110 milligrams of potassium, and then 10 milligrams each of calcium and magnesium. So how do you determine your specific electrolyte replacement strategy? Well, you got to do it first by calculating sweat rate. And here's how you do it. First, you get naked and you weigh yourself. Then you go out and exercise for about an hour. You also record how many ounces of fluid you consume. And then when you get back, you do some math that looks like this. You take 16 times your starting weight minus your weight after the hour of exercise plus the amount of fluids you consumed in ounces. And this will give you your sweat rate loss per hour in ounces. And then you'll need to calculate that into pounds and then kind of figure out your electrolyte replacement based on the numbers I provided. Now, if you don't want to do this, head on over to the Endurly website where we have a blog on how to calculate sweat rate and electrolyte replacement. If you want to make things super easy, you can pick up some Hydrate Elite 2 where we have a full spectrum electrolyte profile to help replace all those critical electrolytes.